Hello everyone, how's it going? Doctor Incompetent here and let's play some Death Stranding, shall we? Well, guess what? I built my own little watchtower here just for fun. Uh, just to see if I could do it. And now I'm looking for some chiral crystals, I suppose. We need to find them. Uh, there's a, a grenade over there that's been destroyed. There's resins. There's a bridge resins okay well i'm still looking for crystals it's funny i was finding them pretty easily before and we'll go ahead and just run i'm okay with this terrain this game oh oh there's bts okay well i'm not okay with that is that what's going on here or what was that why did the game go in slow motion like that there's a chiral crystal let me see, am I in the, near the BT zone? No, the BTs, I think, are in this... Oh, wait, no. Let me let me zoom out. Can I do that? Uh, incinerator. Coronet City. Uh, maybe this... Is this yellow thing the protective barrier around the waste station? No, that doesn't make sense. Um, you can see how many materials are available at a given facility by moving the cursor over the icon on the map. Oh, okay. Note that these materials need not be used only to manufacture weapons and equipment. They can also be claimed in order to upgrade structures elsewhere. Right. So I could take as many materials as they're going to give me and go into the field and upgrade stuff. I don't really understand quite yet. Um, I guess my BB would be going off. It was... Yeah, okay, never mind. Now it is going off. There are BTs. I mean, there's time fall. Okay. something. I feel it. So it's over there. So I'm going to just creep. I don't know if upgrading like dynamic structures that have been built by players is a wise investment. Are they always persistent? Like you know how sometimes in Dark Souls the messages might be different based on the server. They might fade over time. Oh, wrong button there. Um, you've collected enough chiral crystals to complete the order. Now we have 54 um, CG but the guy wants 100 so I'm going to try to do a really good job and get him some more but we have some BTs uh, that are you know, roundabout so let me try to avoid that. Anyway, in Dark Souls the messages would sometimes fade and so I don't know if you want to like, invest in structures that have been permanently built Oh, God, there's one right there. The game has built them. Or if it's always smart to just invest in player structures. Um, my resins got ruined by the rain, by the time fall. Oh, God. I keep pushing the wrong button. <laughs> there we go. How much do we have now? Now we're good. What is this? Oh, there's a BT right there. Good Lord. Let's just kind of creep away from that. Hold breath. I'm holding the breath. The breath is being held. Alright, so hopefully I ninja into that area successfully. It seems like it. Alright, and I'm going to just kind of let that pulse and pulse and pulse. Alright, good. I feel okay to just stand up and run at this point. Breathe easy, Sam. I'm clear of BT territory. Ah. To survive, we need to find another way. A way to overcome the BTs. The Death Stranding, the whole damn mess. Okay, so it is funny, you know, Rick and others were commenting little Timmy in, in the, uh... Oh, here's some more stuff, right? Can I get this? Yeah, take it. Boy, maybe I went a little too far from the base. 
I like went into BT territory for no reason. All right, anyway, let's go get this in. <laughs> we were talking in the comments like, we don't really know what the Death Stranding was yet. We know some about the game, but we still have a lot to learn. Oh. The process is pretty simple, though. Okay. Access the delivery terminal to drop off any chiral crystals you're carrying. The delivery terminal. All right. Um. <laughs> I love all these little random signs people put up. There you go, buddy. Take some some likes. That's right. No peeing right here. Cheerleading acceptable. All right, here we go. Activate terminal. That is the jump. Boy, I'm bad at that. All right, here we go. All right. Um. So we want to make delivery. And we want to deliver requested cargo. And we've got... No, not that. Uh, let's go back. Um, no. Recycle. Make a delivery. No? I don't want to deliver the chiral printer, printer interface. I want to... Deliver the crystals that I've got. Um, I don't have that. I don't want to claim materials. Recycle? No, nah, that can't be right. Um, no. What am I doing here? Chiral crystals can be recycled. Oh, it is recycle at a terminal by selecting delivery terminal recycle. Okay. Gee. Well, I guess if I read everything fully, yeah, it was kind of highlighted. I just felt like I didn't want to waste the quest item. I didn't know if this was just something you use to, like, as a currency exchange for, like, resin for materials or something. But anyway, um, we're going to go ahead and do this. And I'm going to select this, and we're going to give them... You can have all of them. I don't really need them. Oh, they just want that much. Okay. There you go. Here's your stuff. Got some kind of crystals for us? You're right, buddy. These crystals only form in places with elevated carillion levels. Which makes me wonder if expanding the network has something to do with it. <laughs> Damn, son. That is a lot of crystals. That's right. All right, so he's happy about it because I got so many. The mi the minimum was a, you know, we got a big multiplier there. The distance traveled was a little questionable. All right, great. And we got an S. Benjamin Hancock has provided design data for container repair spray. Oh, cool. So I can maybe fix stuff that's been damaged by the time fall? New interview data acquired, chiral symmetry and chirillium. Chiral crystals can now be used at all UCA-affiliated affili facilities. The amount of materials that can be used at the distribution center west of Capital Knot City has increased. A new option has been added to delivery terminals. Claim materials. Okay. Excess chiral crystals can be deposited at any facility. They'll be added to the stores held on site. Great. These local stores include materials that you can draw upon to fabricate equipment as needed. Great. Recycling weapons, equipment, or materials at a facility will increase the amount of materials available for use at that facility. These can be then used to fabricate any new weapon and equipment that you uh, require. I love how they keep talking about weapons. I carry a ladder and a baby. I don't know what kind of weapons we're talking about. Can I shoot the BTs with a laser gun? 
Um, all right, my connection level has increased, and we have new hologram data for Bridges Guard Macho. To use this, gain access to a level two or higher structure and select customize structure. Some of this facility's bandwidth has been shared with Sam. Um, more structures can now be built within the chiral network area. Oh, bandwidth is the gatekeeper for how many different structures you can build around in their area of influence. Okay, interesting. All right, so here you go. And now they can hold more as well. Wow, look at that. Our connection level is, is flying up. All right. Um, all right, and what happened here? Ooh, delivery volume. Raise it. Great. Hey, we got 28 skilled handler. That's right. You can you have achieved delivery volume grade 10. You can now carry more cargo. Oh, okay. Well, that's nice. All right. Is it the hat? There's some boxes. That's container repair spray for patching up cargo containers. Ah. Good for dealing with time fall degradation and all that. And all that. Useful stuff if you and your cargo have been through the ringer. We've added it to your supplies list, so it's readily available if and when you need it. Muchas gracias. All right, so we got some... Very, very nice container repair spray. It's like shark spray, except it fixes containers and has nothing to do with sharks. Okay, so, um, hang on tool rack. Where's my tool rack? Oh, on the side? Cool, yeah, put it on my tool rack. All right. Um, oh, I need to uh, select this and uh, can I just put it in my private locker? And I'm going to put this on the tool rack. Sweet. Private locker. I got an EX grenade and container repair spray. A capsule containing Sam's condensed bodily excretions collected when he uses the shower. It breaks open when thrown, releasing its contents into the atmosphere. So, I don't even want to think about what we're talking about with this. I'm like, oh, it's a grenade. Yeah, no, it's just your shower water. Uh, we throw shower water at people. It explodes. They don't like it. It, it affects BT, so that's good. Uh, we could also maybe throw it at some mules. Um, I definitely want to try using this tool rack. Oh, no, don't. Yeah, confirm it. There we go. Okay. Okay. You needn't worry though. Local chiral density is still within an acceptable range. If you find any more, be sure to collect it. You'll be well rewarded. If you come into more chiral crystals, you can submit them at one of our facilities. And you can deposit other resources too, along with any items you don't need. Everything has its value. What we don't use as is can be broken down into components for R&D and other applications. Okay. I like how many people jump into, like, the holographic conversation when I'm trying to offload my stuff. It's like, hey, wait a minute, heart man. Wait a minute, hard man. Like, wh how are you guys getting into my co phone call I was having with the site manager here? Anyway... Um, I do want to go ahead then, and let me try to use a tool from my belt. Um, can I... I kind of want to use the spray. No, that's not it. Um, EX grenade. Yeah, here's my spray. All right, I want to use it on this and spray my stuff. So, how do I do that? No, that wasn't. Now I'm... Oh, I got container repair spray. Okay, 150. Yeah, can you use it? How do I do that? 
I punched somebody in that case. Um, that's holding my breath. That's crouching. Uh, oh, right, right, right. Use it. Oh, you spray it on something in the field, but not something on your backpack. I see. All right, let me actually... Can I just... I have a bunch of stuff that I don't think I need. Um... Donate weapons and equipment. Yeah, look at this. Container damage. I mean, it's so damaged. Um, yeah, you guys can have this. Anything else that's been, like, damaged beyond repair, these resins have. I don't know if container damage 100 means, like, there's, no there's nothing that people can even use from it. Or if it means that it's about to break. Man, my boots are about to get wrecked. I gotta watch out. Can I repair this from here? I got my backup boots, but look at my boots. 62% damage. We gotta fix that. Alright, um, anyway. You will not be able to reclaim it. Yes, I'm fine. Take my resin. Okay. And can I claim any cargo? What you got? Lost cargo. Cargo for delivery to Waystation West. Right? Climbing anchor... Grenade. This is my stuff. Okay. Um, what about... Uh, fabricate equipment. Okay. You... Unable to fabricate. Oh, I need the printer interface. Right. We got to go get that. So let's get that so we can at least fabricate some equipment, I suppose. If my shoes break, I have a backup pair of shoes. I got 14 likes for putting in those busted up resins. I really want to get this bicycle. Alright, dude. Let me keep people waiting. Alright. So we need to go, I think, this way? Wow, we're kind of in the... Uh, the gully here. Nice ridges protecting this area. Natural defenses for this UCA facility. Alright, let me look at the map. Yeah, I just need to head down here into Mule Territory and raid their post office box and try to find this printer that they stole. Look at these footprints. These aren't mine. These are the mules, I think. But I could be wrong. Or they're another player. I, I honestly don't know. Well, now I don't know what's going on. sideways be ready to fight um i just want to tell you subduing mules press x to attack so that's how i fight you got like a a gun or something katana like i need i need a little bit more for fighting than what you're giving me here all right so i see a bunch of footprints and honestly i don't know if these are mules or uh Use this and R to select and equip a strand. A strand can be used to quickly and silently render enemies unconscious. What do you mean a strand? Oh, I have a strand. It's my rope. Can be used to bind human enemies from behind and parry attacks at close quarters. Okay. So I'm using my blood rope. Use this to prepare the strand. Oh my god, it's like piano wire. Then use this to bind an enemy. If you can sneak up on a mule from behind, you can use a strand to bind them. You can also use strands to avoid mule melee attacks, although your timing will need to be just right. Interesting. All right, I'm going to start creeping because I, their footprints were here. There's a rope over there. So this is the rope that's made with my blood. It's called Death Stranding. My last name is Strand. I'm using a strand to bind mules who are work-obsessed ex-carriers. Yeah, just a little bit of uh, fun with the word strand. All right, so I honestly don't know where... Oh, here's more footprints. Okay, I thought they stopped for a second. 
then I can stop creeping until I get a little bit closer to their area. If these are indeed the mule footprints. Do do do. My shoes are breaking. I mean, my shoes must be terrible. I'm just saying because uh, I have shoes I've worn for years. And they're not wearing out. This man has been wearing shoes for a couple of days. I guess it's the time fall. Your chiral crystals. The number of chiral crystals crystals in your possession is displayed. Yep, yep, yep. Oh, okay, I've gotten this tooltip before. Fantastic. And here's a bunch of destroyed resins. Now, I don't know if I can use spray to bring something back from the brink of destroyed. Let me just try it really fast. Like, here's destroyed stuff, right? So what if I did go over here? That's the wrong button. What if I did go over here and uh, selected my spray, right? And I just, like, sprayed that. It looks like it's actually getting better. I don't know how much I need to spray to make it better. It says fully restored. Now, it says destroyed on there. But does that is that just because it hasn't updated? Or does that mean because the contents inside have been destroyed? I'm going to pick it up. I don't know what it's going to do. But anyway, I'm interested. I'm going to go back to selecting my strand. I might need to use this here rope. Alright, and um, I'm going to uh, like this ladder a little bit. Thanks for the help, Thanks for the help for you. buddy. And we're going to grab it. I'm going to use it. Wow, this is uh, quite the ladder. Alright, there's the, the quest just going over there. I almost broke my legs, I believe. But we're okay now. Alright, let's see where the mules are. Remember, Sam. Before you approach the mule drop site, we recommend you use a watchtower to confirm the location of the post box containing our cargo. Okay. So do you want me to build a watchtower or use a watchtower? Okay. So I don't know if I brought enough supplies to just fabricate a watchtower on site. Um, a well-placed watchtower can prove invaluable when uh, reconning mule camps and their structures. Use this to use the watchtower. Okay, well, I can build one, sure. Is there one near me? Um, no. Cargo scanners and mules. The Orodec cargo scanner can be used to locate cargo. Right. Thanks so much. Okay. Um, mule boots. Boy, I do need some boots. Alright. I'm going to go ahead and try to make... No, I don't want... I don't want a post office. Um, or a post box. I want... Uh... No, I don't... Switch structure. Yeah, yeah. Uh, watchtower. Steep slope detected. I don't think so. These slopes aren't steep. You're steep. Oh, there's uh, some bugs. Let's go get these things. Snatch them. That's a lot of bugs. Alright, great. Where can I put this thing? Obstacle detected. Alright. Um, here we go. Building structures will take up chiral bandwidth. Right. Alright, I'm building this anyway. I wonder if the mules can notice this. Like, hey, some jerk over there just fabricated like a 300 meter tall watchtower. I can see it. They're trying to spy on us. Heck yeah, complete. Alright, let's use this baby. Use it. Alright, let's see. Where are they? Mule boots. Destroyed resin. Oh my gosh, I see it right there. There's a bad guy. Um, zoom in. Zoom in. Yep, there they are. We know they're over there. Alright. 
Okay. So the bad guys are over there where I placed my marker. What is that? That's not my marker, is it? Oh, no, there's a guy. Oh, I wonder if the watchtower is updating my heads-up display, like, on the fly. Because I can see a little box over there moving around. That would be cool. Now, this is... It looks like... The, is that the post bo box right ahead? That's where they want me to go, is straight ahead. But then, if I... Uh, uh, can I zoom in on this at all? Anyway, you can see... No, um, yeah, here we go. You could see that this box right here is a baddie. I think. Because it's like moving around. Yeah, that they've marked it for me. Sam can hide in grass. I'll hide. Your drop sites are rarely deserted, so remaining undetected is key. Keep a low profile and move slowly to minimize noise. Oh, I'll keep slow. This is going to be the lowest profile you've ever seen. Such a low profile. All right, we're going through the grass. Low pro. All right, so we got to stealth it. Looks like there's a cave entrance here. I'm going to try to exploit the terrain. The, the road does go right through this, unfortunately. But maybe there is a reason to use this. There's some... Ah, these are just items. Do I want this stuff? I guess why not? Here you go, buddy. And yeah, we're just gonna kind of carry that on the old back. There's a guy with a four thousand pound backpack coming out upon us. It's sticking out the size of a small car from his back. He's trying to sneak through the grass as if that would conceal him. All right, <laughs> look at this sign. Somebody put this like up arrow sign. This is sweet. It's, well, it's meow lo meow Alright, let's go up then. Let's see what happens if I... I'll just climb up. Looks fine, actually, for climbing. Sam's good at this. Too far from cargo. Oh, I lost where... I got too far away from the cargo that I was marking or something? I don't know what that means. Alright, let's look. This is a beautiful countryside. Nice water fall running through the crags all right let's kind of take a gander mm -hmm. losing cargo you've picked up cargo that you find along the way and subsequently lose may sometimes be delivered to a share locker near its intended destination by other porters well thanks so much other porters all right yep look this is their little base we have a medical tent. It's very nice. You should be proud of your base. Okay. Um, so, that's my marker that I set. There's a mule there. There's a mule over there. And there's the location down here. Now, I'm going to um, just ever so discreetly repel down this Let me see. Yeah, there's definitely a dude right there by the post box that we're going to have to take out. Alright, so let me use my little stake. Climbing anchor. And we're just going to kind of obstacle detected. Nah, there's no obstacle. This is like the perfect place for a climbing anchor. How dare you? Why would I not put it here? Alright, let's go up. Can I put it? Oh, where can I put it then? Alright, let's... Can I put it here? Boy, maybe this is too... Here we go. Finally, I found the place. Yeah, put it there. Alright, now we're going to use this. Don't mind me, Mr. Mule. 
I'm just going to back off this cliff. I see a guy with about 50 crates strapped to his back. He's slowly rappelling down the crag toward me. Should I do anything? Confirm. No. Let him approach. Alright. Um, I made it. I'm on the ground. I'm releasing the rope. I'm now sneaking through the tall grass. Alright, this guy's over here. Oh, he's got his back to me, it looks like. Let me see him. Yeah, he's just sitting there, like, just contemplating how much I'm going to wreck him with this strand. Alright, we're going to bind this guy up. Somebody has suggested using a bridge over here with their sign. That's pretty cool. Uh, maybe I will. Maybe I will put down a ladder. This is like the... This is so funny. Look at this sneaky operation. I'm in the grass, right? And I'm going to pull out a ladder. Don't mind me. Is anything going on over there? No, it's just someone placing down a giant ladder. I mean, think about how loud this would be. But it's okay. Because it's me, Sam Porter Bridges, doing the most stealthy stuff imaginable. Alright, now I'm stealthy. Infiltrating a mule camp. Crouch. Yep. Holding your breath will make you even harder to detect. I'm gonna go slow. Alright. I don't see any other mules here. They've got shovels, cots with sleeping bags, some milk crates. All manner of good item. I don't know what these sandbag log things are. Are these just steps? Like safety steps that they've put in? Alright. I'm gonna go slow on this guy. Who's just sitting there. We're gonna hold our breath. And we're gonna go over here. And I'm gonna kinda... Get right behind this dude. And... Find him. He's been wrapped up. Take that. Alright. And then now I can unlock the post box. What's inside? Do we get it? Yes. Here's the printer interface. Take it. Carry it on your back. I mean, look how much stuff is here. Can I take it all? Uh, what do we want? Well, I definitely want these boots. Put on. Put on footwear. My boots are all busted. I don't know what container damage means. You mean these boots have been damaged externally? Their container has been damaged, but the boots themselves haven't been damaged? I don't know. Anyway, I'm going to wear these, and then... Materials for large-scale construction. Uh, all right. Take that. On the back. Performance enhancing. Yeah, take that. Um, special device. Take that. Oh, I might be too heavy. No, no, I'm okay, actually. I'm almost too heavy. All right, now I... I'm just going to take what I've got. We got it all. Now, um, I want to just make sure that uh, with my cargo, I'm... Looks like you've got an empty container there, huh? Do I? Feel free to submit junk like that to Bridges. You might not have a use for it, but we do. Empty container. Cargo and chiral crystals that no longer fit... For purpose could be recycled. Okay. Um, oh, this these metals right here. Um, I'm actually going to... I didn't realize I picked these up. I'm going to offload that. And then I'm going to auto-arrange cargo. Okay. And then we're going to confirm. I don't want the empty container. I need to 
get a little bit of extra weight anyway. Um, this guy is tied up. Can I do anything to him? He's just down for the count. Wrapped up. God, that's embarrassing. All right. Let's just run away. I don't think any of the other mules can see me. You know what I mean? Like, they're so far away from the camp. I might as well just kind of all out run back. Oh, wait. What am I doing? I should use my ladder. These new boots fit me like a glove. A boot glove. I feel better already. Alright, let's go. I don't think I need to use my rope. Like, I think I can just walk right through this. Unless there's some kind of explosive trap. I'm going to stop crouching. And just kind of start moving. As much as I can. I'm holding the straps. You know I will. Go, 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 Sam Porter Bridges. You're doing good work. Uh, are we talking BTs? I heard some noise. Am I being detected by a mule, or what was that? Oh, maybe they were just telling me that I can't tell if that's the ominous BT noise or if that's like the mule almost saw you or something or what that was supposed to be. But I'm fine. What if I just built a post box right next to the mule post box and then put the chiral printer interface in there? You think I'd get credit for doing the quest if I, uh, if I did that for them? I'm going to try to grab this ladder, actually. Oh. Ah, we can grab the rope. This is fine. And we'll just fall right off the side. Like a glove. All right, there we go. Right downhill. Mules. Damn addicts chasing a cargo high. Cargo they high. They deal with their bullshit at all. Back in the day, AI did everything. Deliveries were handled by unmanned vehicles and drones. Exactly. And all we had to do was sit back and let them work. God, the good old days. It was revolutionary. Damn near singularity. No reason for it not to take off. But it didn't. People didn't like it when we took the human element out of the service industry. Industry. So Interesting. Consideration, we put it back in. Made jobs no one really needed and gave them to folks who couldn't live without them. And from there, it snowballed. Now we got cults of cargo chasing crazies who get off on hijacking shipments. Jackal's always on the lookout for the next porter. Make sure you're not him. All right, so first of all, I think porters can be male or female. But second of all, all you need to do is make a cult of people who think they're police officers. Uh, to go out and hunt down the mules. And then you can just have these, you know, adrenaline-looking people who get adrenaline from doing menial service tasks fighting each other out. It's... pretty much takes care of itself at that point. Sweet. Chiral printer coming in. Coming in hot. That is the 
the idea, though, that AI will replace all service jobs. And service is unfortunately one of the largest employment sectors, at least within the United States. Imagine not being able to work for FedEx. What a disaster. The human element of Amazon delivery is why I order from Amazon. It has nothing to do with the convenience or the price. It's all because of that human element. All right, we're going to deliver your lost target. Here you go, buddy. Complete it. Get it in order. It better be. You doubted me. I know what you did. Let's try to get that connection level up to four stars. All right. S rating. Sam, how are your shoes holding up? My shoes were about to break. Well, I imagine. Conditions being what they are out there. Yeah, I had to use mule boots. It ruins your day like shoes falling apart while you're on the job. It's bad. Carry on like that, and it's only a matter of time before you injure yourself. Bunions. I've arranged for boots to be added to your supplies. Thank God. Bridges standard issue, so they ought to fit you fine. You should always carry an extra pair. Thanks. But if you forget or run into trouble, you can fabricate another by a terminal at one of our many facilities. Good. I'm pleased. Um, we got new interview data acquired. Cool. Some more story going on. And now we can make, oh, a bridge. Well, this is just strictly better than my ladder bridge. Fantastic. Probably takes a lot more materials, but still. We did not get up to four stars. It's really tough to get to four stars with this guy. He's slow to trust people after his bad relationship. And so four stars is going to require a little bit more than going into mule territory, if you know what I mean. He is happy that we got all this other lost cargo. We're getting closer, though. Where does this stuff going up? Bridge link? Yeah, bridge link up to two. Delivery volume 13, miscellaneous 15. See you around. Hey, man, I will see you around. Congratulations, Sam. I understand you now have access to a chiral. Thank you so much. An extraordinarily useful device that can only function because of the manner in which our network utilizes the beach. Okay. Enabling us to transfer the beach since under normal circumstances such transfers would take hours if not days some have speculated that the chiral network might in essence be a time machine that it is transmitting data into the past suffice it to say we have yet to fully grasp the fundamental nature of the network and the beach which we have come to rely on uh -huh. one might liken our relationship with it to that of primitive man's fire is it useful Quite. Is it dangerous? Undeniably so. Nevertheless, we have decided that the reward outweighs the risk. Furthermore, as the BTs are linked to the beach, it stands to reason that further study and experimentation could be of considerable benefit. Okay. The same said regarding you, of course. Now wait a minute. Rest assured, I will keep you apprised of what I learn. You have my word. I really trust you. Great. All right, so we've got new jobs, and I got a bunch of stuff on my back. Uh, I want to kind of offload some of this equipment, and we're rocking and rolling. Chiral Printer Online, Chiral Crystals Delivered. Members and patrons, thank you so much for selecting this game for the monthly choice. I really appreciate it. I appreciate all your support so much. If you'd like to consider becoming a member or patron to support the channel, that would be amazing. Everyone, thanks so much for watching. I'm still enjoying this game a ton. Have a great day.